Alrighty, folks, we gotta keep the train going. Up next, we have a game changer for anyone who needs to represent objects in 3D. Please welcome Ankit Fogat with Vector Edge. Hey, Bria. Hey, Kevin. Hey, Ankit. Hey, everyone. <laughs> they, don't, they don't give a shit. They really don't <laughs> give a shit. No, man, it's because they love you, they revere you. <laughs> okay, okay, so... <laughs> so most of us use Illustrator for graphic design, and the designs, they end up everywhere, from T-shirts to billboards. But there is no easy way to visualize how the designs will look in their final form. Imagine I'm working on the launch of a new skincare product line, and I want to see how my designs will look on actual products. So I downloaded this stock image, which is similar to my product packaging. Now I can use this image as reference and try placing my assets. This logo will go on top. This one goes on the side. It looks a bit off, so we can use a warp tool like the free transform to align it with this side of the box. It's getting better. And it looks OK. But you can imagine if I have to do this for every single asset, it will get very tedious. What if there is a simpler way to do this? Introducing Vector Edge. Now, using the same image and with just a single click, I can place my designs on this box. Wow. Wow. I can make my designs smaller, larger, or rotate them however I want, and they always stay aligned. And with Vector Edge, it can automatically attach to multiple surfaces wow. and sail the box. <laughs> and if I feel like it, I can even fix it to three sides at once. Oh, my God. <laughs> OK, now the box is done. Let's take a look at the contents inside the box. Let's start with this bottle. And we can see that it's not really a flat surface. But no worries. Vector Edge understands curved objects as well. And I can easily place our design anywhere on this surface. I mean. I'll just rotate it a bit. I just got a real good joke. This is called thinking outside the box. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Come on. That's the box. He's outside the box. Huh? You want to know how I made it? With shit like that. All right. Let's go. It's good. It's heat. Go. I think I'm drunk. <laughs> OK. Now, this one is even more complex. It's curved on one side, and it flattens out as you move to the other side. But Vector Edge is up to the challenge and perfectly understands the details of this object as well. Dope as hell. Wow. So I can do this easily. You loved it. Wow. And you know what? It's really fun to play with. All of this is done using only a single JPEG image. And the best part is our designs are still vector. So no matter how much we zoom in, they always remain nice and crisp. Wow. OK, the designs are good. Let's move on to our launch event. This is our launch venue. We already have the logo and some product information, thanks to Vector Edge. But it looks a bit empty. So we can use this beautiful painting to spruce up the visual appeal. OK, the walls look good. Next, let's add a couple of standees. I can add the standees to Vector Edge with a simple drag. And just like that, 
very new room. Wow. But it looks more like a sticky than a standy. Standies are meant to stand. No worries, Vector Edge can handle that. And voila, the sticky becomes a standy. Wow. Not just that, our standy can automatically become larger or smaller as you move it around the room. I'll just place it here. All of this with just an image. That's Vector Edge reimagining the way we visualize designs. Thank you. Give it up for Ankit Fogel, everybody! Good job, man. Good job, man. Now, Kevin. Yeah. I like the use of the word voila. I heard you say voila. it. Voila. Voila. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I just like the fact that you give the awkward beat after I say something, and you don't say anything back, and you just turn <laughs> <and> you <laughs> <laughs> He goes, yeah. <laughs> Okay. It didn't close to start to hear. It's really dope, man. Good job, man. Good that job. That's amazing. All righty. Now, Kevin, can you see you and your teams using this type of technology? You know, I actually can. And, and to be honest with you, uh, in my world of business, a lot of this stuff actually makes sense. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's things that you overlook. You overlook the word of creative that's, the word of creative that's attached to things like this. And when you're still seeing people find new, uh, exciting ways to um, expand on what has already existed but improve upon it, of course, that's what the world is about. It's about growth, it's about constantly breaking new ground um, and just being responsible for the new gateways to, to creativity. And I'm listening and watching people that are clear examples of that. This is dope to see. Um, you know, of course, if I ever wanted to use any of it, I'm expecting a major discount. Uh, <laughs> just like, Listen, the man's right there. Yeah, He's right no, there. Ask yeah. him. By the way, no, I don't have to. I'm, I feel like uh, he committed to that by having me here. <laughs> so um, a conversation is a waste of time. We're partners. We're partners. Uh, yeah. You heard it here. We're partners. <laughs>